Good afternoon everybody! This is a different YouTube video because we will discuss about the top 10 books about lighting standards that I really read just to make sure that I understand the lighting standards. Okay, it is very important for us lighting designers to learn the standards because this is what we usually follow. And of course, all our lighting designs based on achieving the lighting standards. Otherwise, it will be just an architectural artistic lighting. It will not follow anything. It will not be based on anything. Okay, so here are the top 10 books about lighting standards or lighting design manual that I read to make sure that I fully understand and I am really professional in lighting design. All right, so let's go. Number one is the SLL Lighting Handbook of 2018. This one, I bought it uh, during my first year in Dubai as a lighting designer. I really have to have this one because it's like a, a Bible or a guidebook for everything. And this is my first investment as a lighting designer. I personally bought this one, the SLL Lighting Handbook. It's a complete book about lighting design. Then the next one is the LG04 Sports Lighting because strong lighting before is more of outdoor projects. And most of the time, they, we always got a sports lighting project. That's why I bought this LG04 handbook or design manual. And it's really important for us to understand this one. And especially, I'm, I am mastering golf course lighting design. That's why I, I also bought this LG4 sports lighting guide. Then the next one is the LG06, which is the exterior environment. This book is all about exterior environment like facade lighting, landscape lighting, everything with architectural lighting design. So this one, because my boss noticed that I'm very good in facade lighting, so um, I focused myself on creating lots of projects about facade lighting before. And this book really helps me a lot because uh, this book really guides me into how to create a very good exterior lighting designs okay and then lg07 offices that is i think this one is the very basic book that you need to read because uh, most of the regular projects right now are offices and because offices requires really a good lighting because of you know the, the effect of light on humans so take your time to save money and buy this book it's really important, LG07 for offices. And then another lighting guide or LG from Sibse, which is the LG12 emergency lighting, because most of the project that we have requires emergency lighting, either standalone um, central battery system emergency lighting or, um, or a combination of both. So yes this lg12 emergency lighting design uh, guide me on how to do the emergency lighting design and the better selections of emergency lighting not just in the calculation but also on how to select properly the emergency for a project and then the number six is the ies lighting handbook of 10th edition i got ninth edition from the office it's a very old one but i pursue myself to buy the 10th edition so i got the ebook of ies lighting handbook 10th ed edition and this one is from uh, north america so it's american standard and i think it's very important not only to learn the european lighting design standards but also american because some of the clients requires a north american standards and then number seven is the ANSI ASHRAE or IS standard. This is the 90.1 of 2019, the energy standard for buildings. And I bought this one because I, I took the exam for LEED certification and the LEED certification, one of um, the reference book for the LEED certification or the LEED GA exam is about this um, ANSI ASHRAE standard. So I bought this one not because I'm a lighting designer, but also I'm a lead professional. 
And number eight is the Advanced Lighting Guidelines. I got this ebook from the internet only, and I'm I'm so lucky that I have a copy. And it's really a thick book. I I I printed this book in our office, and until now I did not finish it. I just go through it every time I have a project related to some of the topic. So yes, Advanced Lighting Guidelines. I will check if I can still share with you the uh, ebook link for this one. All right, number nine is the SLL code for lighting. Again, it's from Sibse. Yeah, okay, so this SLL code of lighting is all, I think this is so similar to lighting SLL lighting handbook. I will double check. But also I got this a hard copy of this one and also e-copy. And yeah, it's part of the Sibse uh, book collections. And then last but not the least is the ILP, the Outdoor Lighting Guide. I think this is a British standards for light, outdoor lighting. And um, yes, it's part again of my LEED certification and it's more of outdoor lighting guide or lighting standard. And I mentioned before that I mostly work on the sports and facade lighting and landscape lighting before. That's why I took this one. Okay, you can notice that I am not so focus on mo on indoor except for the offices because uh, in our office i usually do the outdoor lighting designs including the road uh, facade and landscaping and sports lighting okay so these are my top 10 books or light for lighting design standards or lighting design manual one is sl lighting handbook two is lg4 for sports lighting three is lg06 for exterior environment Four is LG07 for offices. Five is LG12 for emergency lighting. Six is IES lighting handbook. Seven is ANSI ASHRAE IES standard. And eight is advanced lighting guidelines. Nine is the CBC SSL, SLL code for lighting. And ten is the ILP, the outdoor lighting guide. All right, so if you have the same collections of books to become a professional lighting designer just let me know and comment it in our comment section and i hope that i give you some tips on how to become a professional lighting designer so just go and grab a copy of this one i'm not promoting their books but i'm just telling you what are the books that i collected to become an efficient and effective lighting designer and of course this um, video is part of my book how to become an effective lighting designer and if you want to buy a copy of this book just go to amazon.com and grab either the e-copy of this book or the hard copy so okay it's the hard copy is not uh, it's not showing here but i already got the hard copy and Yep, maybe next time i will tell you the uh, top 10 blogs for lighting designers that's would really help us to become an effective one so see you again on the next video and don't forget to enroll in my udemy courses to learn on how to become an effective lighting designer using dialux evo software or photoshop and autocad and other stuff here all right see you again on the next video